Dr. Natoli at Functional Spine and Sport. We have Dr. Schultz here with us today. He's having some medial elbow pain, right? The flexor tendon. Um, it's painful when he goes into straightening it. It's painful if he's been holding it in deflection or just you know laying on it for a while and then has to go to straighten it. It's also painful with pull-ups until he gets warmed up and it's right at the tendon. So that's consistent with early tendinosis at the flexor tendon here. So as I palpate the area, I can also feel it's thickened, which means it's not as healthy as it should be. And down into the flexor group, he's got a little bit of adhesion right in there as well. So that's gonna put unnecessary tension in there. It's gonna create a inflammatory environment so you can get some tendonitis, with, you know, sometimes I'll call it golfer's elbow, but it doesn't explain why that is inflamed. It doesn't actually fix it if we only treat the inflammation. So we're gonna treat the tendinosis with instrument adhesion release. Over a series of visits, we'll get this to break down and help it heal and repair and help give him the guidance on avoiding it, although he kind of knows what to do and what not to do. So this is very gritty, and you may even be able to hear it. That grittiness and that noise is the adhesion and it's worse right at the flexor tendon. He doesn't have any other signs of nerve entrapment. The ulnar nerve of the cubital tunnel feels pretty good. And again, based on his history, it's not neurological in nature. So we know that it's been ruled out. And it's starting to reach dose. It's getting a little sore and swollen in there. And there's a lot less grit. So we know the adhesion's breaking down. All right, great. All right, thanks for watching.